Just Izzy. It's a mana beast. Isn't that a flamey? Flamies were once. They just call it the flamies. I don't want to. I won't hurt the mon, a mana beast. If you use up all your mana power, you'll disappear too. Little Gurren Lagan Nia sort of thing once the mana beast is gone. My world is separate from this one. It just means I won't see you again. True. All right, let's go. Let's go. Come on. Goon didn't come all this way. Just a bitch out at the end. Mana sword will appear. Let's go. We're following her because she's the leader right now. Revive the mana sword. It's a small ass platform. Nice, thanks. That was super cool. So what, you just hit me for free damage? Is this like a ceremonial boss fight? That's so cool. Like, it actually is a really cool boss. And especially because it makes the same sound. It's going to do the fireball thing again. Hoping you could time a hit against them. There we go. Yeah, it seems like this is kind of just a a visually cool boss fight, but yeah, that's it. That's kind of disappointing. No, I didn't want to kill him. No. Man. Finally seeing the end of this game. That's it, man. Secret of Mana. And I don't remember anything about the end, but we're going to lower the volume a little bit. We're not going to hear the ending music very loud, unfortunately, because ending music always gets copywritten. 
copyright claimed super hard. And Goon is not with us anymore. That much I remember knowing was going to happen. Not nah, Goon said goodbye. And after all this, our two heroes look at each other and say, Do you want to smash? I'll never forget you. Ooh. <laughs> Why they do the spacing like that? And Dialuck too. I wonder what these two do at this point. The Mana Beast is turning into snow. Oh god, this is some god of war shit. We shall bathe in the light of our enemy. We did it, guys. We actually did it. This feels special for me. Just knowing how long I've played this game, how long this game's been a part of my life. How I grew up watching my grandfather play this game all the time. Never saw the end of it in all these years. Just never was able to fully dedicate the time without being ADHD brained and moving myself off to a different game. And we find, I finally did it. This is one of the games that's like at the corest of my heart. Easily one of the five games that if I had to say, you know, from the earliest part of your life, what were the five video games? Because I've grown up my whole life with video games, watching my parents play and stuff. And I would say the games that are imprinted on my soul are definitely Secret of Mana. Breath of Fire, Illusion of Gaia, um, obviously this Secret of Mana, what else would there be? Secret of Mana, Breath of Fire, Illusion of Gaia, I know there's one that I said that I'm already missing again, um, Zelda 2 is definitely in there because like that's one of my like my earliest memories of gaming was that one. I don't know, I'd have to pick a fifth. What would be a fifth one? Hmm. The Witch. The Lion, the Witch, and the Audacity of this bitch. Zelda 2, Secret of Mana, Illusion of Gaia, Breath of Fire. What would be another game that would be super imprinted on my soul from an early age? It would be between Zelda 1 and Zelda 3. I don't know which one was like a part of my childhood first. Probably a link to the past. Probably. Funny that of the games imprinted on my soul, two out of five of them are Zelda games. Either that or it would be Final Fantasy VI, but I think that came out a little later, like 1994, so that might have been after. But then Illusion of Gaia might have come out at the same time. I don't know. Where that comes back to daddy -o. Wow. 
Oh, man. <laughs> Lee Wayman. It's Wayman. What are these two talking about over here? Is my village about to welcome me back? That'll be a question for the ages. Oh, they did. Focus group. Simon and Max Coons. Take it easy there. Bro, I would not go home back to these people. Is dad going to say he's proud of me? What, did we telepathically fucking sword in the stone back again? Gave it the old reverse King Arthur. Hey, oh boy. Part of the spirit world. Look at him. The end. What a fun game. Bright colors, beautiful music, good music all the way around. What else can I say? It's everything that I play games on this channel for. It's why I have this hobby. It, it doesn't, for me, get much better than this right here. This is what it's all about. Just good, old-fashioned, fun fucking gaming. But that is it for this, guys. That is it for this series. And, I mean, shit, we have Pokemon ending right now. Basically, right after this. And I'll be done officially with Super Metroid in not much longer. So, I guess I'll have a little bit of time to figure out uh, what we're going to cap off... Uh, what's going to replace this. I think it's going to be Mega Man 4 for the Game Boy, but we'll see. Peace.